pipe. Uh, we've got five sections out. Uh, put it over in the bank. If we disconnect, I think we'll just go full sand. This, this is the main channel coming out of Axie. On. Still got our Still got our uh, camps down below. Here's Axie. Gap in there. Another channel right here. And over against the hillside over there, you can see the third. Three channels about equal size. Axie, there must be a pipeline goes in. Water. That's just one of the, one of the channels. pipeline down there. Chair from uh, Hannah's Monument, Persimmon Grove. Uh, our road going up uh, about halfway between uh, Persimmon Grove and the old homestead. Just looking across. Close up there. Water's running all the way through. This is right below the homestead. Uh, water apparently, when the main blast came through, uh, this was flowing water through here also. It's kind of dried up now. I believe, it's kind of hard to tell. I believe that this is where our diversion is. Uh, main channel is right over there. And you can see we're losing water all along that bit. I, I'm south of where the last picture was shot, a couple of hundred feet. This is as near as I can tell is a diversion would be right at this point here then it flows right through here and uh, the water is coming out of the main channel splitting at this point so we've, we've got an awful lot of water it's not going down our ditch as much as it's going right after it gets past the diversion it's going over the top. Okay. So there's just uh, lots of water right around me here. That's the main channel again looking where the diversion was. We are at the uppermost part of our property right against the Lives. Uh, see the cedar posts about two, two and a half feet above the, the ground. That's the main channel. Our fence is down, laying against the uh, ground. I think there's probably about eight posts. Maybe eight to ten posts. I don't know if there's a stream on the other side of the wash. Can't get over there to tell. 
There's our old beaver. Beaver dam, there's his lodge. That was high ground not too long ago. That's where his dam was. <clears throat> right in here is where our diversion in it is. If we had a deeper channel cut below us on our diversion, that would uh, take a good, a good share more of the water down. I think we'd be in better shape. Just this whole bank right through here. We're losing water and throwing it right into Axie. Uh, right in the center of the picture there is where our uh, irrigation canal is. You can see we're losing an awful lot of water right to the south of it and then to the north of it. We're losing a lot of water out of our main channel. Where our Flume's at is right in there. It looks like it's still intact. It's just plugged up and throwing water over this way. Yeah, I'll put the camera down, see if I can get over there and take a look at it. Partial flume. I'm down from there a little ways now. And then plugged it, and it seems to be fine. No problem. The water. Each one of those channels is a about four feet deep. It's fast flowing. I'm on the other side. Uh, our fence is still standing. He caught a cow. As far as I can see, it's all there. Looks like we've got quite a bit of brush and stuff packed up against it, but that's not a very fast stream over there. If we don't get any more big gully washers, we should be okay on this thing. Yeah, there'll be some labor involved, however. I know you're all amazed by my camera ability here. Michelle knows that I'd cross the stream with this camera. My ability wouldn't amount to much anyway. That's about where our little spring comes up over on this side. One of the floods opened up for us. It's in here somewhere, right there. Little dicky bird, I guess. The growth cottonwood, it didn't have any flooding occur to it. Uh, still all intact. This for Terry, so she can see what this place looks like. I don't know if this is even going to turn out. It doesn't look too good. Everything's so bright right now. The sun's looking towards our west fence line, uh, splitting point. The main channel once again. Little focus here. And it splits there at three and goes off uh, a little bit north of the channel. The main channel. That's where Stan and I repaired that fence once again, this section right through. Right through there. Uh, at our diversion point is right there. We're losing 
water, it's hard to see it, but we're losing water north, and a tremendous amount of water is, we're, we're splitting right here, and that little dam, man-made dam breaks at this point, then we're losing water. Maybe if we piled up some uh, rock and stuff right across here, maybe that would save us an awful lot of water going down in Dexie Pond. I'm going to use this log as a reference point for where I'm talking about. Uh, there's our irrigation ditch. If nothing else, those backers bushes do hold a ditch. They do keep it intact pretty, pretty good. Uh, basically, from this point, About a third of the way from the wash all the way over to the bank is all uh, flowing towards actually. Uh, some of it misses, but a, a good half of it or more, two thirds, runs into actually in this point. View crossing the stream. Pond once again. I think uh, if we could build gabions up by our diversion and keep the majority of this water, majority of this water in the, the main channel, that'd go a long ways towards protecting this part of us. It's only my opinion. From up above, got about five, six sections. Water goes and cuts right at the base of that pipe. Uh, I believe we might be okay, if, unless we're full of gravel, I don't believe that we are. But, uh, it lifted it up, either that or just uncovered it and pushed it up and packed gravel underneath, I'm not sure. But we've got one end out of the water, unless we're out of the water down at this point over here, unless sand's packing into that pipe, we ought to be in pretty good shape. One, two, three, four, five, six. So. I don't know what we can do about it. Maybe in baskets, right along this point through here, and shoot the water, get a canal dug right out along here, and that would probably save our pipe from now on.